South Africa is experiencing more power supply disruptions than ever before. Luckily, it's possible to incubate and hatch successfully, even with constant load shedding. Here is a step-by-step -step demonstration on how to connect your incubator to an affordable backup system. We will need the following. A Delta Incubator's dual voltage automatic incubator. We have the 56 egg model here as an example. But all dual voltage incubators in our range have the same capabilities. A 12 volt battery, 60 amp hour or bigger. Bigger is always better. We have a 90 amp hour battery here. A deep cycle battery is a great long term investment. A trickle charger, available at most auto and battery stores. The trickle charger will make sure your battery is fully charged and ready to take over once load shedding strikes. We start off by connecting the trickle charger to the battery. Make sure that you connect the red clip to positive and the black to negative. Most trickle chargers will give you an indication that it is charging. Next, we connect the 12 volt supply to the battery. Take care to connect the red crocodile clip to the positive and the black to negative. Plug in the 12 volt supply to the DC jack on your incubator. Your incubator should turn on. It is also a good idea to keep the main power connected as well as the 12 volt. If the main supply is connected, the incubator will always choose that as the primary power source. Only when the power fails will it start running on the 12 volt supply. You can confidently take on load shedding with this cost effective backup solution.